So we just got some brand new details on Star Wars Jedi Survivor through an interview with the game's game director and I think this sounds quite interesting. We could obviously see in the trailer that there were multiple ways of using the lightsaber but he explains here that we're actually gonna have five different stances in the game. One of them I'm assuming is just the normal single bladed one but then we have a dual bladed option where you flip around more spinning around and then there's another stance where you have a lightsaber and blaster simultaneously and a fourth one where you use the cross guarded lightsaber we can also see in the trailer which is more of a heavy stance and he says that we have to choose as players which one we think fits best for each enemy. I would guess the fifth version might be dual wielding lightsabers, but I'm really excited that we get to choose ourselves. It's a little bit like in the first game where sometimes it was better to use the dual bladed saber and sometimes the single bladed lightsaber, but they've just added a lot more depth to it, especially with a blaster since that obviously gives you more range compared to just being able to throw your lightsaber. I also wanted to remind you if you guys want the novel that actually spans in between Fallen Order and Star Wars Jedi Survivor and hopefully tells us what happens with Merrin and Grease. You can get it completely free as an audiobook if you go to my audible link in the description below. You can sign up to the trial, claim the free pre-order of the book and cancel the trial but still keep the free book. And you can do that for any other Star Wars book if you prefer that too. But still, free book for you, you help out the channel at the same time, don't miss out.